here at this NFL Foundation Community Day at the beautiful Tottenham Hotspur Stadium. Delighted to say that Ledley King joins us. Ledley, you've done a few of these kind of events now. How great is it for you to see this great stadium used in this manner? Yeah, it's fantastic. And, uh, you know, uh, I would say that when, when this stadium was built, the vision was to, to, to make a positive impact in the community. And that's what we're seeing here today. You know, we're seeing uh, local school kids here, you know, engaging in, for some, probably the first time in the NFL. Um, and, and, of course, playing football as well, um, which is fantastic. It's fantastic to see. And, you know, hopefully, you know, it can change. For some of them, it can, you know, be lead on to uh, employment opportunities in, in, in the future. Who knows? You know, we talk about sports, but we always talk about this, the, the, the playing side. But there's so many other avenues in, in, in sport and opportunities for people. And uh, hopefully some, some of these young people will, will, will find some of them today. And with this new stadium, the redevelopment of this area as well, I mean, you've been so involved in all these community projects. Just how much of a difference have you seen over this last three, four, five years that we've been out here doing these things? Yeah, yeah I've seen, uh, I've seen a, a huge, uh, the huge difference that it's made. You know, I've, I've met people um, three, four, five years ago that were kind of uh, on, on, on the road to nowhere, so to speak, really struggling. Uh, now I see them working within the stadium. Uh, you know, which is fantastic for me to see, or, or working within the foundation, you know, and that's what it's about, you know, trying to make a difference, help people, and, you know, the stadium's been able to do that. Have you become an NFL fan because of all this? Yeah, I'm starting to really enjoy it. I've been to uh, the last three years in a, in a row now, I've been to games here, and I'm, I, I know the rules, and, uh, you know, I'm starting to enjoy the games. Uh, the, the turnout for the last game uh, was unbelievable, atmosphere was fantastic, and, uh, you know, it just shows how, how much the NFL is growing over here in the, in the UK. And it's, and it's great that it's able to bring so many different people from different backgrounds all over the world to the Tottenham area, which is fantastic. Does it feel like a different stadium when you're in here for a Spurs game versus when you're in here for the NFL? Yeah, it does. And, and I think that's, that's the great thing about it. I've, you know, I've been here for concerts. I've been here for boxing. I can't get enough of it. Um, here for Beyonce earlier this year? Yeah, I was here for Beyonce. Yeah, of and, and Yeah, of course I was. <laughs> um, but it just feels totally different for every, you know, for, for everything that, that it has, which is which is great, um, you know. Even still, me coming to the stadium and seeing the NFL pitch is still something that I, you know blows my mind, really. So no, no, it's fantastic. And we saw Ange Postecoglou here this weekend. Turns out he's a big NFL fan as well. Talk to us a bit about the impact that he's had around this place in the last few months. Yeah, it's, the impact's been huge, and uh, you know, I had an opportunity to see that uh, at first hand on the preseason tour. You know, the atmosphere uh, around the place. But then the performances as well, you know, in pre-season. Uh, and then you, the question is whether you can translate that into the Premier League. And, and we, the team have been able to do that. You know, it just seems like a real happy place at the moment. The fans are so engaged and, uh, you know, players are playing with a, a freedom and, and, in a, and, a, and in an expressive way um, that, that is creating great football. So, you know, we realise there's a long way to go still, you know, only eight games in and... Uh, a long way to go so I'm sure the manager and the, and the players won't be getting carried away but they'll be enjoying what they're doing at the moment. Enjoying it is uh, for me the right word because when we've spoken to guys they seem to be having a lot of fun is that your impression of the, of the players this year? Yeah definitely definitely and, uh, uh, and that's from the manager he said that he wants training to feel like when they were kids so you know as, as a player that's music to your ears coming every day looking forward to enjoying your training you know it sounds so, it sounds so simple um, but it's, it, it really is not like that every day, you know. So to come into training and, and, and to feel like a little kid again is an amazing feeling. And, you know, we're able to see the players really enjoying their football and, and they're doing that on the pitch. And you talked about the atmosphere here on game day, whether it's NFL or, or for Spurs, but you've been in those Tottenham teams who have been to finals, who have last time they were winning trophies, right? It's the atmosphere that's around here now, the coaching that's around here now, does this feel like the sort of thing where maybe we could see Spurs finally get over that hump again? I think the main thing is that the, the team are playing with a confidence and a, and a, and a, and a freedom. Uh, and when players play in that way, then you know, I always believe you play your best football. Uh, and having no fear as well, that is something that, that, that you can see throughout the players, you know, regardless of the opposition. It's about playing uh, our game uh, and believing that we have players that are capable of winning any, any game at any given time. And I think that always helps you to, 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 to achieve your best results. We're having a lot of fun watching it. I hope you are as well. And enjoy the rest of today. What a great event. Thank you very much. On AM, on DAB, via the TalkSport app and on your smart speaker. TalkSport.